What's going on, everybody? Welcome to G Myers World, and today is going to be our third Solo Battles Blitz pack opening. So I hope you guys have been doing it. I've put out videos to help a lot of you guys um, get the maximum amount of yards and stuff that you're supposed to be doing. Hopefully, you guys are you know taking advantage of it and seeing what you can do to get these packs because you're going to average about maybe like 150 a day. You know what I'm saying? Like with the 15 plus the 100 from the touchdown pack and whatever, um, you're gonna you're gonna average a decent amount a day. So I've been getting asked a lot of questions about. Um, you know, Telvin Smith and stuff like that. Guys, feel free to go ahead and go to twitch.tv forward slash G Myers World to see all my live gameplays. If you want to see actual gameplay with the cards, um, if you guys give this video enough likes, I'll get you some more. Let me see. What, how many likes do we need right now? How about we go for 237? So the 237th like, tweet me, and then I'm going to have to get you guys some gameplay pretty soon so you guys can see what's going on right here at G Myers World, all right? So um, this one, the first thing we have to do, we have to get the coins that we get from that pack. I mean, from the, uh, you know, from the bundle that you get from the solo battles being ultimate tier. And another question that I was asked, which was very, very interesting. If you guys want to know what the minimum score is, because yesterday I think ultimate was, um, was it 80K? I think it was 80K yesterday. I believe it was 80K. All right. So if you want to see what it is, right, this is what you're going to need to do. You're just going to go over to my rank and you see like how it's 80 because the first day it was 90. Remember the first day when they first started, it was 90. Now it's 80. They made it a little bit easier because people are having difficulty getting ultimate. Plus, in addition, it's a lot of weird things that go on inside solo battles, as a lot of you guys may know. I've already tweeted out asking you guys, and I think it was retweeted um, a very, very ridiculous amount of times about the people that get ridiculous things happening to them inside of solo battles. So I just want to make sure that you guys stay up to date with that information to know that it will vary, and it definitely does change, so pay attention to that. That's very, very um, important for you to understand that the minimum score is not as high as some people may have said, uh, it, you know, to you or, you know, whatever. However it happened, it's just not what most people are saying is what my point is, okay? So here we go right now. We're going to see. Okay, Hail Mary. Okay, what is, okay these are series uh, two tokens. All right, let's go. Next thing, let's go. Come on, give me something good, bro. Give me something good. Give me, give me something good. Bro, it's a silver pack. Okay. Bro, oh, sil more silvers. Oh, okay, another silver? Oh, okay, so more silvers, okay. Thanks, EA. Yo, bro, see, this is the most annoying part. And a lot of you guys are like, yo, G Maya, risk it all. Take the touchdown pack. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro, you guys really want me to end up in the morgue, though. Like, Derek, is he going for anything? I don't think he is, though. Is he? I don't think he's a good power. I'm, I'm gonna check his price and see what's good, but I don't know if that's good. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see about that in a second, bro. We'll see about that. Let's go. All right, what, what's this? Okay, he's garbage. Okay, can, can I just get one elite? One elite? Ah, bruh. Ah. So here it goes. It gets interesting now. What do you do right now? What would you do for a Klondike bar? See, I don't know if we go for the touchdown and go for it all, or do we just take our coins and just say, you know what? It doesn't really matter. We're not about to do this right now. What do we do in this situation right here? I really don't know, man. It, it's it's very, very difficult to determine what we should be doing right now. I just don't understand it. Um, uh, this is just like, it's really like making me rage just to know what EA is going to give me out of the red zone pack. But if we, okay, so if we go 25 and then the 75, we'll have 139K and then we'll be able to, nah, we, we ain't do it. Listen, I'm not even going to, bro, let me tell you what I'm doing. I'm taking the coins and I'm running. Like, I'm not even going to deal with this with you guys because the chance of me pulling something good is less than slim to none. Like, like you know what I'm saying, bro? None left the building. It's no way pop. EA Sports, I don't want to talk about the stuff that just happened in my last game. You guys, go check out. If you guys go to my uh, my last stream on twitch.tv forward slash Gmiles World, check the last game that I played. I played this idiot that's like a top 100 player. He's a moron. And um, the last play of the game where I threw the ball to Randy Moss, Randy Moss was burning his corner. And then it glitched up, and then the guy caught up to me to swat it. It was really, like, I re EA has no love for me. So what we're trying to do right now is we're actually looking towards a goal of getting Sprinter Chem on my players. All right? So I think we have, I forgot how many we have, but we're going to go check it right now and see what's going on. But we're going to take the coins, and I'm going to show you what my plans are as far as going forward. And also, let's check to see, do we have any regular solo challenges available? All right, no, we only have the training camp that gets unlocked at... It gets unlocked at level 60. Okay, so cool. All right, so let's go ahead and back out of that. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're at level 53. Do they have anything for um, the Mutt levels? Is it, has any of those been unlocked or what? Okay, so unlocked 54 and 58? Okay. 
All right, so I just wanted to make sure about that. So our next level, we're going to have some of those solos to do. All right, so let me go over here now. We're going to go take a look first at Derek Carr's value to see what's going on with that. And then from there, where's Derek? Where's that? Where's the, uh, the newest? From there, we're going to, let's see, what do you, what do you go? I think you're garbage. So, yeah, and I was right. Bro, somebody, bro, a bid price of 150 Yeah, that guy sucks. But then they got the primetime performer or something like that that's selling for pretty hefty prices. So I guess nobody's really going after that card, um, it appears. All right, so look, we right now, I'm going to show you what I'm doing, right? With the Sprinter Chem, I th what do we have, six or five? Let's check how many we have. Sprinter Chem, where's Sprinter Chem? Bro, where is it? Why isn't that showing up here? What, what's going on? Is it all the way at the bottom? Why would EA put it at the bottom? Is it at the bottom? Is it even anywhere? Okay, Sprinter, so, okay, oh, because only five. Okay, so we have five of them active right now, right? So now, each one of those are a 1,000. So what we're going to be doing now is we're going to start to uh, – I was thinking about doing the defense first, right? So right now we have it on uh, Telvin Smith. we got Ryan Shazier, Miles Jack. Who else do we have it on? Who's the other guys? What, Randy Moss and Tyreek Hill maybe? Okay, Tyreek Hill, Randy Moss. Okay, so that's the five right there. I was thinking about giving it to Ricky Williams, but then I thought to myself, at some point Ricky Williams is going to make me just – you can't really get rid of Ricky Williams – but do we want to use a thousand on them now? Where, in my opinion, as far as the running back goes, because like even Barry Sanders can't really burn people, you're gonna still get chased down by a D tackle. Should we give it to Jerry Rice, okay, to make him a little bit better? And that's a very interesting question because that may be what we do. Because I don't want to give it to like a guy like John Ross or this guy Jakeem Grant because he has a 92 speed, make him a 93. Because ultimately, he doesn't have any stats that's gonna help us get off the press and stuff like that. Like he doesn't have. He's just a fast player. So if we do give him that speed, the only thing he would be good for is possibly... Hold on, wait a minute. What's his spin move? Does he have any spin move? Hold on, let, let me check this out. Uh, jumping, elusiveness, 79. That's low. Spin move, 70. Yeah, so we can't, we can't even put him on kick return. So we actually have to keep it the way it is. So for anybody that would be asking about why don't you give it to the other players that are going to be faster anyway, um, that's, that's more than likely why. Because if you see what Randy Moss's stats are, Randy Moss is almost unpressable. Like, you, you pretty much, like, his beat press is so ridiculous with the chem, and I'm about to finish chemming it up, so it's going to get a little bit more ridiculous. Um, it's something that really shows, with, like, you see how his beat press is 93? That really shows up. Now, when I get it back to 94, because I think the go deep, we're at 25 right now, right? Let me go over here and check. Okay, so we're at 25. When we get to 30, you get, oh, deep accuracy and deep route running. So, you don't, so we already get everything else with the beat press. So we got all the beat press. So we don't, technically, we don't really need this. Because the deep throw accuracy, Tom Brady's going to throw the ball, you know, pretty decent regardless. He's going to be that guy that makes those plays. So I don't really see um, any other reason to um, go that route. Okay, so what we're going to do right now is let's start looking. Um, which one do we want to add it to next? We could probably add it to this guy. Because with these guys that are the team diamonds, you get to add double the chemistry. So I'm going to have to add other players to put their lockdown back. You understand what I'm saying? Like, Every one of them, if you, if you guys have unlocked any of the Team Diamond players, where go, when you go down to the physical, you can add an additional chemistry from whatever you've been using prior. So even though, like, over here has the Sprinter Chem, you still have options to add more of this stuff. Only for, like, the Team Diamonds right now. All right? So as I take these guys away, I'm going to have to add more players that, in turn, gives me lockdown back to keep it at 30. So I got to watch that. So I'm not really in a rush to get that done. But I think what I'm going to do right now is we're going to add it to Sean Taylor. Okay? What what we what we will do right now is we're gonna see if we can lurk a decent price eighty nine overall. Let's see if we can lurk a decent price eighty nine overall because I just want to get as many training points as possible. Getting to seven seventy five hasn't really been doing it for me, so I want to spend more money and just be an absolute idiot. So that's what I'm gonna be looking to do right now. Maybe we can start sniping eighty nines because this guy's an eighty eight at eighty nine k. That's not bad. Okay, so. Instead of going 87s, we go a little bit more and get that. But what's the 89s price? 89. Okay, the 89s are all the way. All right, let's 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 get let's go over here and see what's happening. All right, so let's go to QB. What are the QBs? 88s. Okay, 88, 88. Just a lot of 88s going on, bro. 88s. Okay, nope. So QBs is not not the wave. Because if we can get a cheap 89, bro. 88, 80. Okay, so it's still it's still around the same thing. This is ultimately what I want to get done. So the 88 is there. 89 is 115. Okay, so that's giving us like what, 1100 or something like that? Or 1600. I think it's like 1600, right? So he's 115. Okay, so I think, okay, so wait, let's do the math. 77 is 14. So, okay, we could get this guy because we were spending 
69k, 69k. Let's go 89. Well, well, before we do that, before we do that, let, let's uh, let's go down a little bit more and see what's going on. Okay, now, nah, yeah, the tight end is obviously going to be more expensive because that's where people make most of their coins at. All right, let's see what else we got. 89. Okay, he's at 137. All right, it appears that that wide receiver might be a decent price for that. So let's go ahead and, and grab this Tim Brown because we're just doing it for training points. Um, let's purchase that. And then from there, what we're going to do is, what is it? Okay, so it's 1600 for 89. All right, so we're that close, which means that we could also do the other method that I showed you by making more of the, um, we could actually make more of the, uh, what is that? Those, um, we could use our gold players to do that, to do that set where we can actually get a lot more stuff going on with that. We could actually get the 95 by making the 81 overall elites and just do those four times and then get that a couple more times. So after this one right here, we're going to add training. Um, we're going to add sprinter to Sean Taylor. Okay, he'll be the other guy because ultimately we're going to add it to the people I showed you. Tyreek Hill, Randy Moss. Jerry Rice is making me very angry. He's garbage, but we got we to just keep doing what we're doing. We're, we're already so far into it. It's very difficult for us to turn back right now. Okay, it's very, very difficult. So at this point, we're just going to have to go for it, guys. All right, so we'll add the sprinter chem to him. All right, so he's 6 of 30. So we need four more, okay? We need four more right now to be able to get that plus one speed. That's going to pretty much – it's going to make our team a lot better overall, just making them just – they're going to just be outrageously glitchy. So all these guys have it. All right, we're going to have to do this guy, this guy, and this guy. And then that's going to be one, two, three more. So that's going to bring us up to – what? What is that bringing us up to? Because we have six now. So that's seven, eight, nine. And then we'll have enough. So the 10th person is probably going to be Jerry Rice. What do you guys think about that? Should I even invest in this idiot or should I get another uh, another uh, wide receiver? Because they're going to be dropping new promos. And more than likely, this guy, Jerry Rice, might have to go, dog. Like, he might just be a slot guy or a guy that I, I just get rid of outright. Just get all my training points back and just go in a different direction. But as a matter of fact, I'm going to show you guys what I'm talking about as far as the other set right now that I showed you in the previous video. I'm going to go to um, exchange, and I'm going to go to the low, what is it, the 80 to 80, high goal to 80, 81. And then I'm going to add these into it. And then from there, what I'm going to do, I don't think we need these guys, do we? We need any, bro, this guy, he's garbage. All right, these guys are trash. I don't really care about that. So we'll do this, like, if we get 81s every time, It'll be easier because it'll be closer to 95. Right now we're getting 80s. Jameis Winston is trash. So pretty much I usually get 80 to 81s. All right? You can try to go here to try your luck, um, you know, getting some cheaper ones and then doing it. But I think you should use your goals and just try to 80 to 81s and keep doing this to help you with your training points um, if you have a lot of goals. Uh, if you do not have a lot of goals, obviously – this method, Lamar Jackson is, I don't know what he's been doing. I don't know what he's been doing as of late, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't really matter. We're going to try to get this one done so we can have only three left to go. All right, so they're just going to keep giving us 80s now. Because all yesterday, what? What is this? I added nothing to this guy. What are you talking about? You, you really going to add something to this idiot? Like, yo, back, yo, EA missed me with that foolishness. So we get like two more of those. We should probably be in good shape. Um, to get another sprinter cam for the plus one speed. Now you guys are probably asking, like, what what do I think the sprinter uh, the the sprinter speed? Peter Piper Pit Peppers. All right, so the the sprinter speed. What do I think? What what kind of dimension do I think that's going to add to my team? What it's going to do is right. Look, Tyreek Hill is going to be an absolute animal. All right, because he he'll be at ninety four, and then more than likely he'll get another power up. So what's going to happen with that is you're going to have an absolute animal at that position. So if you don't have a Tyreek Hill, it may, you know, it's probably going to seem a little weird to do it in this. Okay, I don't want to do both of these guys. We'll do it like that. Um, it'll probably seem a little bit weird for you to go through this process right now and um, do it to the receivers that you have right now because you, Tyreek Hill is pretty much the X factor. He's the guy that he's going to get behind the defense more often than not. All right. So when I when when everybody gets the plus one speed, he's a guy that I think that you guys should make sure that you have on your team. All right. If that makes sense. Now, his power up is still pretty expensive. And that's simply because everybody knows, you know, his speed threshold. Everybody knows what's going on. So that's why that situation is like that. But don't make that deter you from getting it done because he's absolutely worth it because it opens up and he's decent run blocking wise also because Jerry Rice and him is like pretty much, you know, they're very close to each other with the um as far as that goes. So just so you guys know what's going on with that. All right, so now we have six. 
right? Um, we have to add it to these idiots now. So I'm gonna, I have some things that I have to do because we have enough to be able to do it. But like I said, I'm gonna have to add some things to these players and see what's going on with that. But for now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take it away from Adrian Amos and then it's gonna affect everybody else's overall. We'll do Amos first. And then it's, once we once we change the lockdown, it's going to change everybody else's um, you know, everybody else's overall. So that's going to be an issue that we're going to have to deal with because now it's going to be 29 of 30. So we're going to have to start adding players back. All right. But we could do that easily by, you know, getting some of the um, the uh, the rising stars and stuff like that and continue to contribute. So that's just the idea that I want to make sure that you guys understand. So as of the end of this video, let me just show you where we are. What are we at? Seven. I believe we're at seven. And EA makes we have to go all the way down to the bottom to see it, which doesn't make any sense. But we have seven. So three more, and we unlock that plus one speed that is going to make us pretty good. You know what I'm saying? Like It's, it's going to be pretty glitchy out here, guys, just so you know that. All right? So I want to thank everybody for watching. I'm going to see you guys and girls next time. One love.